Now let us understand what are smart lanes in Swift Kanban. Smart lanes add tremendous flexibility and visualization to your board. It helps you to manage work having different workflows separately. After you enable and define smart lanes based on card attributes, the cards directly are placed in the applicable smart lane. On moving a card into another smart lane, the card attribute is reset automatically. Let us enable smart lanes on the Kanban board. Click the Modify Process button on your project Kanban board and click the Smart Lane settings in the board designer. Click Enable Smart Lanes to choose one of these two options. You can define smart lanes in two ways. If you select the first option, you can generate smart lanes based on any of these card attributes. For example, let us select Priority and Save. The board will have smart lane for each of the priority value that is critical, high and so on. If you select the second option, you can add multiple horizontal smart lanes. Let us save our choice and add a lane. Say we want to manage a workflow for team A. We'll enter the VIP limit and save. Similarly you can add more lanes and define a workflow for each lane. If you want a similar workflow for another lane, click the copy button for the lane you want to configure. Select the lane from which you want to copy the workflow, for example team A and click submit. Now the team B lane also has the in progress lane split into coding and review lanes. After you have configured the workflow for the smart lane, click back to return to the Kanban board. The Kanban board is now ready with your own value stream. When you add a new card or pull a card, the card will be directly placed in the applicable smart lane. When you move cards from one smart lane to another, the attribute associated to that lane is reset automatically. Note that the priority of the card has now changed to high indicated by three yellow stars. If you have enabled smart lanes based on team members, you can move the card from one team member lane to another. So now the card owner has changed from Derek to John. If you have enabled smart lanes based on card type, you cannot move the card from one smart lane to another. That is, a user story card cannot change to a defect card. Let us summarize the card movement for smart lanes. Smart lanes configured based on card type attributes and team members. Related attribute for the card changes based on the new lane attribute. For card type, you cannot move cards across one card type lane to another as these lanes are tied to a particular card type. For custom labels, you can move the card freely across all smart lanes. The attribute values of a card will not undergo any change as the smart lane definition is not based on any attribute value.